let's see how we do this. All right, so I'm gonna save this drawing as um, using this option on the ribbon, save as. And over here, um, I can save this. I'm gonna rename, I don't know, my temp or lazy template. That's all up to you, right, the, for the name. But the idea is that we can um, save this as an AutoCAD drawing template, DWT extension. And that way, AutoCAD immediately point me to the correct um, folder or path, which is right here, um, which is great. Um, so these are the standard templates that come with AutoCAD, as you can see. Oops, I'm gonna rename Lazy Template. Um, so over here, I can simply click Save. And we could add a description. This is the template for Lazy Architecto. Again, that's all up to you. And I'm gonna click OK. Uh, it says the current drawing was saved in a different location. The one, sure, yes, uh, I'll do the recommended option. Um, now, um, once we have that, I'm gonna close this, of course. And I'm just gonna open a brand new drawing by clicking this sign. As you can see, uh, when I open a new drawing, AutoCAD still is using a default template uh, provided by AutoCAD. Uh, but we're gonna change that in a moment. So uh, let's see. The next um, step to achieve this is going to the options dialog box. So I'm gonna do that really quick. And then over here, what I can do is scroll down under the files tab and find something uh, related to templates. So it's right here, template settings. And here are all of the different paths that we can change. So the important one is this one, the default template file name for QNew. That means when I create a new drawing or click this plus icon to create a new drawing, it will use my template. So I'm gonna go ahead and browse uh, for this. And as you can see over here, now I can select the new lazy template. So I'm gonna click OK or open in this case, and apply. So let's quickly test it. And here we go. Awesome. So the next time, now that you create a new drawing, you simply click the plus icon and your template with your title block and your layers and whatever you add here will be ready to go.